Hello everybody! Welcome back to our channel. We are going fishing at Rome Pond today in Rome, Wisconsin. Ain't that right, Leela? But right now we are in Jefferson waiting for Emily to pick up some meat from the River's Edge Meat Market. So yeah, next time we see you, we will be at Rome Pond. Here we are, we made it. We are at Rome Pond. As you can tell, we are surrounded by water. We're gonna catch all the fish here. And we gotta hike a little bit. So we're gonna hike down that way and do some fishing over there. So here we are, we have made it to our fishing spot here. First time fishing here actually, so it's just a fishing spot. We are next to the road. So there will be a lot of traffic noise. And Leela has finally made it. We have our baby, our food, our stove. We are good to go. So if you're a first time fisher, that is good. Let me give you a tutorial. So when you're using a normal fishing pole, you got to flip this back. And as soon as, as it's all the way flipped back, you put the fishing line up against your finger, like this. And then, when you're ready to yeet it, just do that. And then, do this. And then, if you want to reel it in, you just reel it in. There you go. So we're no experts at fishing. <laughs> Today we are using just bobbers and night crawlers. Nothing fancy. See what we can pull out of here. And Leela did just learn how to use that. She's doing great. And Emily is feeding the Kevin. Woo! <laughs> I am going to get my pole ready and do some fishing myself. Update. We've been caught. fishing for a while now. Have you caught anything, Leela? No. What? No. No? Dang. I haven't caught anything either. I took my bobber off though. And now we are fishing bobberless. And we got these new fancy extendable rod holder things. So far I'm liking it. And Emily has started fishing as well. Have you caught anything yet? No. Oh. Not a thing. Hopefully something soon. And uh, there's a, a lot of garbage laying around here. We might, we might end up doing the right thing and taking that out with us. This is corn. Corn. I am the first person to actually catch something. What is it? I think it's like a carp or something. <laughs> it's not a carp. I don't know what fishes are. Hook is down in there. Yeah, Leela has caught the first fish of the day. Good for you, Leela. Anything to say? I am happy. Good, good. All right, now I'm gonna have to put this down to get the fish off. That was a, a nice little, nice little bluegill Leela caught there. Is that right? a bluegill? I think so. Was that a bluegill? Yeah, we think it was. If it wasn't, let us know. <laughs> what you doing? <laughs> I'm, I'm picking up everyone else's garbage. Oh, those jerks. Almost a bag full here. These people are schlabs. Anyway, so we are uh, still fishing. Leela's still fishing. Emily is eating celery. And uh, I am also getting hungry. So we should be cooking food soon? Yeah, I would say so. So we'll be making some food soon. Some chicken, some steaks, got some potato salad, 
and some vegetable salad and some chip things. No chip things for me. Carbs are bad. So we're going to uh, pack up. What? Been out here for almost a little over two hours. Oh, really? Right. Yeah. And we've caught one fish, and it was you. You caught the one fish. <laughs> so we're gonna go over to the pavilion and make some food. And also, something that's not okay. That. It's gross. Keep what you catch or throw it away properly. Don't just pile fish to die on the side. Thank you. What do you think about being the only one to catch a fish? Awesome! <laughs> We're lucky enough that they still have picnic tables out, but due to, you know, the thing we're dealing with, they have removed the handle and the working parts of the drinking fountain, fountain, and the bathrooms are closed. The chicken has been plopped. It's going to take forever. It's thick. That's some thick chicken right there. Look at this chicken. Mmm. Okay. It's gonna be some delicious chicken. What else you got for us, Emily? A couple little steaks, but those will take like three minutes. And they will go, <clears throat> they will go on this burner right here. Mmm. Steaks and chicken. Mmm. And we also have these pop, pop corners, the crunchy and wholesome popped corn snack. Like, it's kind of weird at first, but these little chips right here, popcorn. Mm, are they good, Lila? Yes. Now she's slapping down the steaks. Mm. Mm. Now baby wipes and some hand sanitizers. Hygiene. Where where did you get these steaks from, Emily? These steaks I got from Imperfect Foods. Oh. Will these be the first steaks we've eaten from Imperfect Foods? Yes. Yes? Well, yes. So we'll have to uh, let you know how we think of them. They look like little steaks. They look good. And I have a huge stick. What do you have? Huge stick. That is quite the stick, Lila. What are you going to do with that stick? I don't know. All right, so we got our food. I have steak that I've eaten a lot of already, potato salad and chicken. It is delicious, not gonna lie. It was a fun day. We caught one fish, <laughs> explored a little bit. We played some hide and seek and some stick battles, right? Is there anything you wanna add, Emily? The steak is really good and bloody. Ew! Mine was bloodier than yours. I like it that way though. And broccoli cauliflower salad with bacon and cheese. I can see that. But it's been a very good day. I like cooking outside and picnicking. Listening to these gunshots. Better luck next time with the fishing. Mm -hmm. If you have any ideas for adventures we can go on or anything you want to see us do let us know in the comments. comments make sure to follow us on twitter 
at JFAM Times. And thanks for watching. Have, Have a, a Johnson-ish Johnson day. day. Thank <laughs> you.